Yo, what's up guys? Today I'm here at 7th Street Public Market because this place holds one of my favorite sushi places in all of town. Like seriously, pound for pound, best sashimi in town. So let's go. Yo, so today we are here at Bonsai Fusion and I am lucky enough to have all this food to myself, not to the camera crew. Anyways, yeah, so I got here some sashimi, some burritos, some, some more burritos. So let's, let's dig in. So I have an unhealthy obsession with sriracha and soy sauce. I don't know why, but it just tastes absolutely delicious to me. So my first thing that I do always is I make my concoction of overspiced and absolutely crazy sauce. So, all right, so let's, uh, let's, let's, I was gonna say let's add this to soy sauce, but let's do the opposite, because I'm crazy like that. And then the next thing that I'm gonna do is actually add some wasabi in here. I actually don't know why, but I don't like ginger. I, I just really don't. So this is probably gonna spill, spill it over, and uh, well, let's just hope that it doesn't. Yes, I do love me some just like super spicy and pungent flavors, so let's go. All right, so one of my favorite things to get here is actually the sashimi deluxe. Yellowtail, tuna, and salmon. So those are like your, really your trifecta of fishes. Now, usually people have a specific order in terms of which fish they eat first, but I'm like, screw that, because I'm just gonna, I'm hungry. One of the reasons I absolutely love eating um, their sashimi here is because the fish is just absolutely so fresh. Like, I didn't get a chance to actually get a picture of it earlier, but they were literally bringing out, like, I think it was, um, I think it was tuna. I'm pretty sure it was tuna that they just brought out. So it's been a while since I've had this, so, I don't know. Tuna for me is like a really good starter fish, and this is really, really good. Like, I need to throw this back into the ocean fresh. Okay, maybe a little bit too fresh. One thing that a lot of people overlook is actually the... Okay, uh, that wasabi hit me. That wasabi hit me good. Let's go. I really like the distinct taste of uh, the yellowtail because it has like it's just good I don't even know how to describe it other than it's just really good this is salmon here now uh, the way I like to tell if it's good salmon is they'll have nice striations on the edge of the fish so you see there this is like really really nice and flatty uh, flatty yes uh, it's it's flatty but now this is really nice and fatty texture and just like, if it's fresh, it should just melt in your mouth like butter. Let's eat some butter. I know my, I didn't really know I shouldn't eat, talk with my mouth full, but damn, that's good. <laughs> I swear. My camera crew hates me sometimes because like the amount of like food I eat in front of them is a little ridiculous and they're all laughing right now, you know, but this is good. So I will go on record to say that this is the first place I know of that had sushi burritos in Charlotte. I know, I know, it's a bold statement, but I'm willing to, you know, vouch for it to say that this is the first place to have sushi burritos. So in the chop chop, I'm pretty sure this is like jalapenos, uh, edamame hummus, um, yellowtail right now from what I can see and just wrapped up in a spinach wrap and I don't know why, but this is, they have like some secret sauce that they put inside and it makes me keep coming back here to eat it because it's so good. Let's go. The slob over here. I don't know why, but I keep... Wow, that's spicy, wow. Okay. That actually hit me like a brick wall. That is actually kind of spicy, I have to admit. 
It's a lot more spicy than I thought it'd be. This thing packs a punch. Like, it's not like the wasabi spicy, it's like, it's just like burning your mouth spicy. In hindsight, I probably shouldn't have put too much sriracha in this, but regardless, really, really good. One of my favorite reasons of, as to why I like eating burritos is actually because the way they blend all of the flavors together and you can grab all of that in like one bite is just absolutely amazing. Like I love salads and I like like poke bowls and whatnot, but like the way I eat a burrito, it just, it's like everything's all there in one bite. So you get just a blend of amazing flavors. I should probably take another bite, but I'm kind of afraid of the spice in this. Touche, touche bonsai, touche. I have an obsession with spicy, as I said. It's a love-hate relationship. I love to hate it. All right, so this next thing right here is one of my favorite burritos. So this is actually my first sushi burrito that I've ever had. This is the Hulk, this is the OG. This is the original sushi burrito that came to Charlotte and took Charlotte by storm, it's, 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 it's amazing. I think what made me fall in love with this is just the concept when it first came to Charlotte. It was so original. Like I've never seen like sushi in a burrito format, but you know what, it works. It's crazy, but it works. So again, I am ridiculous in the sense that I put sriracha on everything. I literally put that on everything. In this case, I'm probably going to regret this, but I'm going to enjoy it first before I start regretting it. I don't know why. It gives me a sense of nostalgia when I can go back and just like... I still remember the first time I had a sushi burrito and it was... It was godly. <laughs> One of the things I actually really appreciate bonsai for is actually their spinach wrap. A lot of people will use like nori seaweed to wrap it up in. I actually prefer the spinach wrap. The reason is because when you use seaweed, if it gets wet or like a lot of the sauces will like soak into the seaweed and it'll actually just make it dissolve. And you know the worst thing that you can have for a burrito is just have it fall apart. So I like the idea of like putting it in a spinach wrap because it just holds it all together and just great idea, great idea. This is so good. I feel like I should stop, but this is so good. I also feel like I say that about every video, so. Yo, so I just had lunch here today at Bonsai Fusion. I'm not gonna lie, it's been a while since I've had it, so it definitely hit the spot that I haven't had in a while. And I really enjoyed it. So thank you again for joining us here today. And if you like this video, please like the video. Otherwise, I will see you in the next one.